The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Sonic Web Studios specializes in custom web design, app development, social networking, search engine optimization, domain registration, email marketing, online stores, and more. Since our birth, we have been designing and developing immaculate websites and providing web solutions which are a cut above the rest. As a leading web designing enterprise, we have a team of extremely talented web designers who are well-focused and have the experience of working on multiple web developing platforms such as PHP, Magento, Custom WordPress, and more. Sonic Web Studios has been helping businesses of all kinds, whether big, small, established, or startup, impress their audiences with exemplary web solutions. We don't just create beautiful and functional websites. We give you a complete online solution with the main goal of enhancing your yearly revenues. We aim to give your business the online exposure and brand acknowledgement that will help you in achieving increased conversions leading to profitable sales. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention The Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, YouTube, iTunes, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and the MikeWagnerShow.com. Mike brings you great guests and interesting people from all across the globe. So sit back, relax, and enjoy another great episode of the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Widener Show. Powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show. Get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Widener Show can be heard on the MikeWidenerShow.com. You can check our Facebook page at Facebook.com slash the Mike Widener Show. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, as well as Amazon, Audible, and Anchor FM. Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Also follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. We're here with a wonderful duo from Southern Maine, which is um, a really happening place to be at this time. And, um, don't get to talk a lot of people from Maine. It does seem like a very nice place. Of course, um, there are two brothers. They've been doing this since uh, 2019 and accumulating a lot of songs and a lot of ideas in their head from childhood until now. So we'll find out all about that. They've got a new EP called Rough Draft. And also they got When Anxieties Attack, Trash, All My Time, Heart Versus Head, Life and More. And we'll be playing one of their songs um, during the show. And live, ladies and gentlemen, from the Plus Studios in beautiful Southern Maine, Ladies and gentlemen, we have David Sprague of Psychopath Etiquette. David, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining us today. Hey, right, thanks for having me, man. It's good to be here. Well, it's great to have you guys as well, too. So you guys are based out of Southern Maine, and you began Psychopath Etiquette in 2019 and be working on everything from childhood till now. You just accumulate a lot of stuff. You also have an EP uh, out called Rough Draft, and you got uh, some tunes like When Anxieties Attack, Trash, All My Time. Also, Heart versus Head, Life, and more. And you just have some amazing stories to tell. And before we get into all that, tell us how I first got started. Um, well, um, I come from a very musical family, so we've always been sort of into music. But my brother and I have been playing together off and on our whole lives. And this band is sort of just like us t- t- deciding to finally take it seriously. Mm-hmm. And how would you come up with the name Psychopath Etiquette? Um, I just love uh, – well, part of it was getting the dot-com. That was kind of big for us. But once we <laughs> – but we were going through band names, and those, those words together just uh, – I don't know. I just like the way that they sound and the way they work and kind of the idea behind it. And what was the idea of uh, Psychopath Etiquette? Well, it's – yeah, it's not really a fully fleshed-out idea, but basically it's just the idea that we're all a little bit crazy, and there's sort of like an etiquette that we're just all following and like – 
kind of faking it a little bit, and some of us are better than others at doing it, but we're all a little bit crazy. <laughs> well, you guys seem crazy about it, too, and it's making me crazy, which is a good thing, and I'm looking forward to what you got. So you guys got a really good start, and what was that one moment that precisely influenced you into forming psychopath etiquette? In other words, what was that moment that said, this is what we're going to do for sure? Um, It was sort of a... Uh, I mean, well, I turned 30. That was a big part of it. But it was like a uh, – I sort of – I was like in between jobs and I was like looking at everything that I'd done and I I started all these projects and never finished any of them. And it was just like, you know what, let's get serious about – just pick one thing and go with it. And so we, in some ways we've done that with the band. In some ways we haven't. But um, it was it was just sort of like a wake up and you're 31 and you're like, hey, let's – Let's make something happen. Mm -hmm. and, and I think you guys are off to a really good start as well, too. And who are some of your favorite artists, singers, musicians, and guitarists growing up in your childhood? Um, well, in my early childhood, like probably the first uh, musician I ever started listening to was Johnny Cash. Uh, my parents had him on cassette, and I used to sneak away and listen to him uh, as often as I could. But after that... Um, I mean, I love a lot of different kinds of music, I love, but I love, uh, like, Modest Mouse and Third Eye Blind are huge for me. Uh, Damien Rice, who's a sort of a Irish-British singer, a songwriter, I, he inspires me a lot. And, uh, yeah, there's a, a bunch of them, but that's pretty much the basics of it. And how do you describe your sound as? Uh, our style of music, how do we describe it? Yeah, how would you describe your sound? So it's um, it's sort of like it's sort of like I try. We're trying basically to fuse all the things that we like about rock with all the things that we like about folk. So we're trying to like not lose the story and the heart and the um, uh, the stuff that we grew up with, but still get to that upbeat kind of energy that rock brings to the table. So it's a little bit of that. It's a little bit of fusion of both. Mm -hmm. And it sounds like you're doing a really good job, but we'll talk about some of your music in just a minute. But first, listen to The Mike Wagner Show at themikewagnershow.com, powered by SoundEquip Studios. Visit online at soundequipstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. SoundEquip Studios is the answer. SoundEquip Studios offers fast, affordable, custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at soundequipstudios.com. Mention Mike Widener show get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Widener show can be heard on the Mike Widener show.com. You can check our Facebook page at facebook.com slash the Mike Widener show. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, as well as Amazon, Audible, Anchor FM, and more. Take the Mike Widener show at the end any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener show on the YouTube channel and follow the Mike Widener show on Instagram and Twitter today. We're here with David Sprague from Psychopath Etiquette here on the Mike Wagner Show based out of Southern Maine. They've been doing this since 2019 and just put anything, everything on the line. They have a new EP called Rough Draft. And uh, tell us about the EP, Rough Draft. So the EP was, it's, it's called Rough Draft because it very much is a rough draft. And it was basically just like, hey, let's get something that like down and recorded that we can give to people right away, like as fast as we can. And so we were kind of in the middle of writing songs anyway, so we just pretty much took the first six songs that we wrote, recorded it in like two days in our basement with like a computer and two microphones. And yeah, so that's what it is. It's it's rough, but it's all raw, and it's uh, – actually, we're pretty happy with it. It's a pretty good representation of – uh, the sound that we're going for, at least. It, it sounds like a really good mix as well, too. And you also have songs called Trash and All My Time, Heart Versus Head, Life, and you've got uh, What Anxiety is Attack will play in uh, just a few minutes. And uh, tell us about some of those songs. So, yeah, it's a pretty broad range. Um, it gets from, like, really aggressive uh, electric guitar to really soft acoustic guitar with piano. Um, but... Yeah, uh, trash versus treasure, uh, trash slash treasure, I should say, is my probably my favorite song. 
Uh, but anxiety atta- when anxiety attacks is the one I think that resonates most with people, and for sure that's what the what our experiences showed us. Mm-hmm. And do you think when anxiety attack has to do with the uh, current pandemic? Um, it was written before the pandemic, but I think that it's one of the reasons why it's resonating with people now has to do with that for sure. I mean, we're all a little bit anxious, I think, so. Mm-hmm. It, it sounds like you had perfect timing right there. It sounds like a little bit of a uh, futuristic. So I think we've covered a uh, trash uh, slash treasure. And I think uh, I'm not sure if we covered all my time, heart versus head and life and um, life. Now you can just uh, tell us about those songs. So, yeah, I mean, all my time is kind of a classic sort of simplistic love song. It's just about um, really the beginnings of a relationship where you just want to spend all of your time with someone and um, just get to know everything about them and let them know everything about you, that kind of energy. And um, so it's not like it's not going to blow you away, but it's kind of a nice just, um, you know, a little bit of a romantic song with a twist. Uh, Heart vs. Head is sort of the theme that goes through the whole album, or I guess EP, and it's just the idea that um, I've been basically battling my heart against my head my whole life. <laughs> and uh, it's debatable which one's winning right now. But um, just the idea that love is really weird and everyone should understand that it is. <laughs> and when you stop to think about it for too long, you get like all up in your head. And so it's really a battle. Um, that's what love pretty much is to me, uh, just a battle. It, it, it sounds like today's social media, it seems like it's not a heart versus head, but you got a third party in there, heart versus head versus social media. It's like a three-way war. For, for sure, for sure. <laughs> you also have another one there, too, called Show and Tell, and just uh, tell us more about that. Yeah, um, Show and Tell is a song that I basically wrote and recorded all in one take. I was sort of writing it as I was recording it, Um, but I sort of fell in love with the hook. Um, It's basically just about um, being like totally uh, honest and vulnerable with someone and um, basically just hoping for the best and, and seeing where it goes, but it's about yeah vulnerability and honesty and the dangers that that entails. Mm-hmm. And, and of course, um, I was going to ask as well too before we play when Zion's attack. Um, what do you base your lyrics on mostly? Um, I mean, I've lived a, a long thirty three years at this point. Um, I have a, 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 I like to think that I've jam packed it full with life experience. So I draw a lot on that. I also get inspired by other songs and ideas and, um, art in general. Um, but mostly I'm drawing from life experience and sometimes it's not as straightforward as like, this is something that literally happened to me, but it's more like the ideas of relationships and the kinds of relationships I've been in. Mm-hmm. will pop up throughout the songs. And what is life like for you in Southern Maine? Uh, it's pretty uh, pretty close to back to normal, actually. I mean, everyone wears masks, but we're all just you know, going shopping, going to work, and coming home and, yeah, watching football. <laughs> there you go. There you go. And we're going to play When Anxiety's Attack in just a minute with Psychopath Etiquette. But first, listen to The Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com, powered by SoundEquip Studios. Visit online at soundequipstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. SoundEquip Studios is the answer. SoundEquip Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at soundequipstudios.com. Com. Mention the Mike Weiner Show, get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Weiner Show can be heard on the Mike Weiner Show.com. You can check our Facebook page at Facebook.com slash the Mike Weiner Show. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, over 25 podcast platforms. Take the Mike Weiner Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Weiner Show on the YouTube channel. Also, follow the Mike Weiner Show on Instagram and Twitter today. 
We're here with David Sprague of Psychopath Etiquette from Southern Maine here on the Mike Widener Show. Right now, here's one of their songs from Psychopath Etiquette's EP Rough Draft, and some of their tunes uh, hit number two on the iTunes chart in South Africa. Right now, here's When Anxiety's Attack, right here from Psychopath Etiquette on the Mike Widener Show. I don't want you to think you need to tell me the truth. To have an excuse When the darkness hits your heart And you feel like it's falling apart Well, I'll be there When you need me When you're ready I don't want you to think you need to show me the proof And I don't want you to think you need to give me the key to your heart When the past holds you back and you're trapped where you are And the shadows have stolen your spark When you can't leave your bed cause you can't lift your head Well there's gas in the getaway car Psychopath Etiquette with from the Rough Draft release that was When Anxiety's Attack on the Mike Wagner Show. And where can we find When Anxiety's Attack and Rough Draft that, David? Uh, pretty much anywhere you look for music. Uh, it's on iTunes, obviously, and um, Spotify. Um, all right, like all of the songs I've ever written, basically, are on SoundCloud if you want to check that out. And it's all just under Psychopath Etiquette, so pretty easy to find. It's a pretty rare band name. And, and by the way, that was a great tune. By the way, I really love it. It makes me think of Smashing Pumpkins in a way. That was a great tune, by the way. So, <laughs> Sweet. Well, I appreciate that. I love the Smashing Pumpkins. Great. Okay. And uh, what can we expect from you in 2021 and beyond, David? Well, actually, hopefully, we're about to get into the studio again right uh, in, the, in the next couple of weeks. So hopefully 2021 we'll have a release of a full a full length album that we really get to sink our teeth into and take our time with. So that's what we're looking for. Mm -hmm. And what are some of the songs uh, can we expect from you then? Um, I'm hoping to come up with just 12 new ones. We're in the writing process right now and I'm kind of happy with the EP, the way it stands. So I don't really feel like remaking any of those songs. I think we're just going to let it exist the way it is and just come out with a full new album. That sounds very good. Once again, David Sprague of Psychopath Etiquette here on the Mike Wagner Show. Just a couple more things. We'd love to have you back on. You've been great. And uh, who do you consider biggest influence in your career? Uh, I mean, if we're going not musical, it's definitely my dad. He's been like my best friend and my biggest supporter of my whole life. So no questions asked there. <laughs> okay. And uh, what's the best advice you can give to anybody at this point? Uh, just, um, it's, you know, it's kind of, it's getting crazy out there. Just, uh, 
but it's it's also a great time to be um, an artist right now, actually, I think, because a lot of people are stuck at home and they've got nothing to do and nothing to watch and they're looking to be entertained. So if you're an entertainer of any kind, there's a way to find a platform. And so basically just, you know, get out there and find it. Certainly will. And once again, David Sprague of Psychopath Etiquette here on the Mike Wagner Show. David, a very big thank you for your time. You've been absolutely fantastic. Looking forward to having him again soon. Once again, tell us about your upcoming projects. What's your website? How do people contact you? Where can people purchase or listen to your music? Um, well, so our biggest thing right now is our Facebook page, which is just Psychopath Etiquette. You type it into Facebook and then we're there. Boom. Number one, top of the charts. Um, and that's where most of our stuff goes through. Most of our content gets posted there. We go live there like four nights a week. So, um, that's the best way to come and like kind of hang out and chill with us. We're also, uh, simultaneously streaming to Twitch all of that time. So if you're down with the Twitch game, we're down there too. Um, and yeah, music is anywhere you listen to music. I usually send people to Spotify cause it's free and they can just listen as much as they want and it's good for us. It's good for them. So, mm-hmm. and of course I'm sure my boys, uh, playing games will be happy to join me on Twitch too. So you get some fans right there. So <laughs> once again, David, a, once again, David, a very big thank you for your time with psychopath etiquette. You've been absolutely terrific. Looking forward to having you again soon. Do us a favor. Keep us up late. Love you back on in 2021 and beyond and keep in touch. You've been great. Uh, thank you so much. I, I loved it. It's good. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Sonic Web Studios specializes in custom web design, app development, social networking, search engine optimization, domain registration, email marketing, online stores, and more. Since our birth, we have been designing and developing immaculate websites and providing web solutions which are a cut above the rest. As a leading web designing enterprise, we have a team of extremely talented web designers who are well-focused and have the experience of working on multiple web developing platforms such as PHP, Magento, Custom WordPress, and more. Sonic Web Studios has been helping businesses of all kinds, whether big, small, established, or startup, impress their audiences with exemplary web solutions. We don't just create beautiful and functional websites. We give you a complete online solution with the main goal of enhancing your yearly revenues. We aim to give your business the online exposure and brand acknowledgement that will help you in achieving increased conversions leading to profitable sales. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Thanks for listening to The Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, iTunes, YouTube, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Please support our program with your donations at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again next time for another great episode of The Mike Wagner Show. 